Inslaget presenteras av Kraft, officiell souvenirleverantör till HV71. HVTB presenteras av Invid, Intersport, Nybergs bil och Jönköpings Energi. Och vi skötte ett uh, got a great win this Saturday, 4-2 against Malmö här i Husqvarna Garden. Uh, Joey Laleggia, how would you describe the team performance this Saturday? Um, I thought we, we started playing our game you know, in the second period. I think we had a bit of a slow start. Um, but uh, it, was, it was good to get that, get that lead after two periods and then be able to hold on to it in the third. I think that's something we can build on going forward. You were down by one, but you never gave up and, and came back strong. Uh, how would you describe the, the turnaround in the game? I think it all started with Herman Hansen making that play in uh, the defensive zone, um, you know, making a good hit and then stealing the puck, coming up ice, and then credit to his wingers and uh, you know, Mons and Mack there, getting to the right spots, going to the net. I think that was a huge momentum booster for us. You scored two goals, uh, pretty important as well. In, uh, the first in power play, the, the second just right after the power play, uh, how would you describe the goals? Uh, it's a privilege to play on the power play, especially you know on this team and in this league. And uh, there's pressures that go along with it. You either have to score goals for your team or you have to create me momentum for your team. Um, there's a lot of games where you don't get very many opportunities on the power play, so you really have to make sure that you make them count when you do. So it was good for us to get that one on Saturday. Besides the goals in Saturday in power play, how would you describe uh, the overall performance in power play? I think it's been, I think it's been pretty good. Like I said, there's a lot of games where you don't get too many opportunities. So as long as you're, you know, if you're not scoring, you have to make sure you're creating momentum for your team. After the game, you gave the helmet to to Andy. He blocked the shots with, with his neck yeah. <laughs> just in the end of the game. What do you say about his performance in the end of the game here? <coughs> I mean, that was a pretty gutsy move by Andy throwing, <laughs> his, throwing his head against that puck. But those are the kind of things that, those are the kind of things that, you know, help the team win. I think Andy does a lot of things, not just on the ice, but off the ice. I think he brings the team together. He's, he talks a lot. Uh, he's a smart hockey player, a smart guy. I think he, he does a lot of things to bring the team together in a lot of situations. How important is it to that kind of performance uh, to send signals for the rest of the team? It's very important, especially a player of Andy's caliber and Andy's you know, status uh, in hockey for someone like that with uh, such a decorated resume as he has to be putting his head in front of puck says a lot. Mm -hmm. And your own start here, uh, Joey, you have been here for a couple of weeks now. How would you describe your start here in, in Hove 71 and uh, the new club? I love being here. Uh, I love it. My wife loves it. We're very fortunate, very grateful to be here for you know the next two years after this one as well. It's a place that I think we can call home away from home, and I think you know we can build off of Saturday and get some more wins and you know really establish this team in the league. Yeah, what can you bring to to Oscar Sam tonight from from the Saturday's game? I think we can build off our performance from the second and third period. I think there are things we, we needed to clean up. Um, I mean, there's, there's always things you need to clean up in hockey games. You know, it's very rare you play a perfect game. Uh, we have a pretty smart coaching staff down there. We have great leadership, and I think we're going to build off of the things we did well and try to improve on the things we didn't. Mm -hmm. And Oscar Samna's uh, opponent, uh, how would you describe them? I actually haven't played against Oscar Sham yet this year. Um, just with you know, the move here and whatnot, I haven't got to see them yet. I do know that they have pretty good high-end talent on their team, and um, you know, just from from last year, teams don't change a whole lot. I find just in their style of play, Oscar Sham, you know, they work hard, they they play together, and they they find a way to win games. So this should be a good test for us. And it's uh, the end of November, and the mustache is growing well, uh, Joey. <laughs> You're giving Mats on a, a really tough <laughs> match there with, with the mustache. No, I don't think I'll ever <laughs> take the crown from Madsen, but uh, it's just a little fun thing we can do, you know, to show our support for men's health. Good to hear, Joey, and good luck tonight against uh, Oscar Sam. Thank you.